Hey guys, greetings and friends. Good morning. It's like it's 10:54 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and 6 a.m. in the morning in Kuwait. I'm watching the Nasdaq futures. The market's been bearish for a while, so here's just some short analysis. We've got a strong support near the 26.85 even region, uh, which is coming exactly from this area. It was one. This it was this, this support was tested twice in the past. One two and now th three and fourth was today the market did break the lows but uh, it failed to go further down so at the moment it's too slow and I can't determine who's in control exactly but I've seen that the low of day has been broken again the previous support has been broken as well so theoretically probably sellers are in control or just it could just be a breakout Anyway, so that's my trading range, which I've uh, the square box, and we've uh, marked the uh, the support in the circle. I did uh, t buy the lows near the support for two points, which is around forty bucks. So here it is. You can see that a previous bear channel that I've drawn, and it's a, looks like a down, downward trend. I hope it's uh, what I expect that market will start some bullishness. So let's look at, here's the trade. I took a buy at 2688.50 and took the trade off at 2690.75. So markets is oversold according, technically speaking, and all these stochastics are trying to point up on the slow charts and the fast charts as well. So hopefully let's see how the market goes up. So anyway, if the market goes up, if the market the bulls are really in control, our entries are going to be on the uh, 20 above 2690 even like 2690.25 and the stop is of course going to go either below uh, 80, it's either the stop's going to be at 85 even or 81.75 and we can target the next swing levels as our target areas for example like 92.50 93.50 or 95.75. These are our target areas. We are long at the moment, so it was a cool trade. I did uh, like took took it at the lows. It was a live trade, and I do trade live and sim both. But this trade, I was confident, so I took it on my live account. Anyway, this is just a small preparation and a small pause. Uh, I look for for your feedback on how we can improve it or what I can do better for you. So it's just uh, I'm trying to do daily preparation for the Nasdaq futures. I trade Nasdaq futures and Russell. So I'll be waiting for your comments. Bye-bye.